Hello, welcome to another EBS video tutorial. This time, we discuss the archive function and how you can initiate it from your remote or from the VGA. Let's begin. During a production, we might be prompted to archive a clip, meaning we would like to send that clip to an X file for archiving purposes or to trigger a workflow created in X-File and X-Square in order to send that clip to post-production. Let's start by activating an auto-archive rule built in X-File 3. Once we do this, X-File 3 will now look for any clips on the Xnet that have been manually flagged for archive by the operators. To access the auto archive function on the remote and flag a clip to be archived, cue the clip, press menu, and then A. You can also achieve this on the VGA by pressing Alt-Z on the keyboard. This function will cause the clip to blink green when the clip has been flagged for archiving but has not yet been archived. It is permanently highlighted when the archiving is complete. Dependent upon the mode selected using the D key, clip versus cam, the archive flag is added only to the camera angles of the clip loaded on the control channels, cam mode, or to all camera angles of the clip clip mode. When a clip turns solid green on the VGA, we know that it's been archived. And to verify, we can check X-File 3. Check our website, evs.com, to find out more about X-File 3. Here, you'll find tutorials and user manuals to help take your production and its workflows to the next level.